All right, guys. I wasn't gonna film anything else. Just got done with the DMZ tour. I was just gonna do like a little intro, but I just got to my hotel in uh, Incheon. It is super awesome. Let me check this out. Check it out first. Give me slippers to put on. Probably because my shoes are supposed to stay out there. But this hotel, let me put the key in the thing. Check it out. Never been in a hotel like this. That's the dining room, I guess. You still on the mat to eat. Bathtub. Fancy bidet toilet. Nice shower. Mirror. And the town below. So I didn't plan on uh, filming it kind of backwards like this, but I'll just do the intro now. Had an awesome day in the DMZ and can't wait to show it to you guys. Uh, the tour guide Nancy was awesome. She went over everything. Tons of detail that I probably can't remember. I'm gonna try and do like some voiceover on spots where uh, there's things that I probably don't remember to say right now that uh, she explained to us, but we went to uh, first the third tunnel. Went to the third tunnel. The third tunnel is one of four that they've discovered over the years. I think it was discovered in like the 70s uh, that, that the North Koreans dug. So. South Koreans dug a second tunnel, connected it. Um, we went to the Dora Observatory where you can see into North Korea. Um, we went to the Freedom Bridge uh, where, where a bunch of the South Koreans that were prisoners of war crossed back over. It was super cool. Uh, hope you liked the video. Now I'm gonna take a shower because it was hot today. Luckily it wasn't raining. First time, time in like four days that it wasn't raining. But take a shower, get changed, and go to a baseball game, which I'm not going to film. But I am going to an actual Landers game in Inchon, or in Inchon, which is why I'm here. So, yeah, enjoy the video. <laughs> this is way better. This is way better. I know I was lying. This is way better than taking the train. Bus is nice. I mean, if it's anything like the other bus, then, uh, yeah. We go to Humphrey, it's like right at whatever time. This is way nicer than taking the train everywhere. Yeah. It's great. They're counting it down. Yeah. <laughs>
go uh, across into the DMZ area. Um, it's a cool like temple-y looking thing with a giant bell. Don't know what that means. But we had to get here super early uh, to get in line because they only issue so many tickets a day to go into the DMZ. Um, it's like owned by the UN, I guess. Like the UN runs it. Um, so it's like a multinational area. The people that live there and work there, although they're traditionally Koreans, like there's no like Korean law there. But we will uh, do the tour of the observation area, the DMZ, and there's a tunnel we're gonna go through, the infiltration, infiltration tunnel that they found in uh, 1970s. Uh, a North Korean tunnel that they have built another attached tunnel to we can go down to. I can't take any video there. can't take any video at the checkpoint. But everything else I should be able to video. So I hope uh, it comes out okay. We'll see. Okay, I found a spot to get some uh, kimchi dumplings while I'm waiting. Because we've got like an hour until we can get tickets. So I'm at this cool little noodle spot. See how they are. Right. Check these out, guys. Kimchi dumpling soup. Oh, thank you. Yes. Thank you. Samida. Some more soup. Check these out, guys. Oh, those look good. All right, just finished the tunnel tour. That was the extent of what I could video because they made us put everything in a locker. It was pretty cool. It was really narrow. Uh, it's actually cool down there, actually, compared to how hot it is up here. You can like see into like North Korea uh, through like the tunnel, like where the demarcation line is. But now I'm going to go into the um, what do you call it? Kind of like a duty free because this is UN, so gonna duty free and see what they got. I hear there's like North Korean whiskey, which would be fun to buy, so stay tuned. All right, finished the tunnel tour. I'm walking over here. I bought a birthday gift from my dad. I got a mail out. Can't show you what it is because this will definitely come out before his birthday. But I'm walking over to the big DMZ, DMZ. I'll check this out first. So check that out. It's a globe. Like 
push in the two. Oh, it's got both halves inside of it. Isn't that cool? Very nice. And that is the big DMZ. All right, next we're getting on the bus again, I think, and go into, I think next is the Dora Observatory where you can see into North Korea. It's up there, up there on the hill. So we came to this uh, like market. It's like a unification village uh, in the DMZ. So the people here don't pay taxes. They don't follow any of the Korean laws, but they still sell to the Koreans and get a Korean passport. So, oh, sorry, I'm thirsty. These things are great, by the way. Low calorie pineapple. It's like a Fanta. Yeah, so a little bit of a tourist trap here. They sell like some soybean ice cream that's like only in the DMZ. 
they sell honey and ginger and all this stuff, but no North Korean whiskey, they're out. Everybody wants North Korean whiskey and everybody's out of it, so. All this way, I didn't even get any. Freedom Bridge. It's the bridge where over 12,000 uh, South Korean POWs crossed back over after the armistice was signed. It's kind of cool. So these ribbons here are uh, the right names of family members in North Korea still. It's like a remembrance thing. It's kind of cool. So, bonus. I was able to get North Korean whiskey product of DPR Korea so hopefully it's good you dying out here <laughs> Steve you'd like to have your mask on leave your mask on as soon as I can as soon as I'm outside, as soon as I put it on to go to the store, someone's got to tell me to put it on. No, yeah, I'm not putting it on until I get back in that bus. It is too hot out here to not put it on. Oh, look at the person way up there. Yeah, Jake say hi. Jake says hi. Steve says hi. Brian says hi. Now he's gonna have to edit. Where's Joe? Where is Joe? I'm sure he's busy doing things he wants to do. The gym. Yeah. That was a fun day. I'm tired now. I need to go to my hotel and take a nap before the baseball game.